here we have the players coming on to court. Two young Japanese players. And a bit of surprise in this uh, women's doubles that the uh, German pair has made it all the way to the semi final, but uh, they've done really well, won all their matches in two straight games. Here, the head to head is in the Canadian Open, where the Germans actually lead 1 0 when they won 21 19 in that third game, and that was in the semi final of the Canadian Open. Black. Stay on the same side. So the Germans won the tosh and they uh, chose to chose ends and they chose the slow side first. And as you can see, Isabel Hatchich standing on the right. The one picking up the shuttle here. And her partner, Carla Nelta. And that will give us a good opportunity here to give a short brief of the players. And here we have Isabel. Sorry, that's wrong. That's, uh, that's Isabel Hertrich and not Carla Nelta, but so um, we uh, have to get that uh, fixed uh, very shortly. This is Isabel Hertrich. Here we got it, age 26, 166 centimeters. And uh, the ranking is 27 at the moment. The highest they have been on that world ranking is 24 with her partner here, Carla Nelta. 24 they achieved on the 5th of July this year and Carla Nelta here 27 years of age 172 and of course uh, the present ranking applies 27 but she has been as high as 17 with her former partner the way to the final uh, sorry semi-final here as I mentioned earlier they won all their matches in straight games and uh, yesterday they had to fight hard in that quarter-final against the pair from Hong Kong, China, winning 23-21 in that third, sorry, second game. The two Japanese here, Chiharu Shida, age 21, 162, and the ranking is uh, 74, and the highest uh, she has been is 48 on the world ranking with her partner here in the picture nami matsuyama age 20 166 and 74 on the world ranking and 48 as Ready the highest. but please don't be deceived because these two young players they really play well and look at the way they in the Second round disposed of Fukuman and Yonao, also from Japan, 21-14, 21-17. That's an awesome win. And not only that, but also the quarterfinal winning against Chao Tong Wei and Cheng Yu in two straight games is a very, very good victory. We have the umpire here, Chung from Chinese Taipei. And the service judge is Huang of Vietnam. So Matsuyama is, uh, she won the gold at the uh, World Junior Championship in 2016 with uh, another partner called Hobara. But in 2015, this combination here won right. the bronze. Nami, Matsuyama, and Chaharu Sida, Japan.
and Amalek, Isabel, Patrice, Carla, Neote, Germany. Carla Neote, Sir, Chahari, Shida. Lavo, Play. wondering, are we just seeing the next Japanese women's <laughs> doubles coming up? I think we are actually as well. Uh, I know at the Canadian Open, uh, Germany beat them, but uh, I was talking to the coach and it was a mistake that Japan made. Um, we felt pretty confident coming into that and they can cut that down. Two, but yes, here comes low. another Japanese team. It's absolutely amazing, isn't it? Just 20 years of age and 21 years of age. Japanese attack. Yes, getting on the attack nice and quick. Yeah. Matsuyama and Shida. Four. And it's Love. Matsuyama who's serving now. And it's Carla Nelta to receive. Four nil. And that's well left out the back. Seven so over. One, four. Ladies and gentlemen, special announcement. China men's single player Chavi will be signing autographs at the HSBC stand in the North Angeles at 6 30 p.m. Pressure of the Japanese duo. They're getting on Some attack. And they're not uh, letting Germany change it around. Watch this. Nice and easy. There it is. Five, one. It's amazing, isn't it? This this combination might be able to get to, yeah into the top twenty <laughs> <laughs> quite soon, which then means that. Uh, Japan will have seven pairs in the Two, top 20. Five. Yeah, the depth in, in Japan right now in the, the women's doubles and women's singles it's, and, the, and the men as well. But uh, yeah. I just remember playing there and actually the women's doubles were, even before Matsutomo and Takahashi won the gold at the Olympics, they were famous. People, you would go out and Three, people would know who the badminton five. players are. So mm. that's good. A great depth and uh, yeah, very different from some of the rest of the world. But uh, it's always good for our, our sport to have a high profile in various countries. Hi! Really deep on the defense, uh, Germany. I know they haven't found the back line, which means they so can step over. up their, their defense, but just watch how, how far back they are on, on defense. Three. I think that will continue when I've been watching these two uh, German players play. It's uh, always been the case that they are backing off quite a lot. Instead of they, they should try to step up and, and no. challenge. I know the the women actually, or, or the doubles teams, they used to be um, in Mülheim, all yeah. the women, and they yeah. just changed oh. it. Now they're in Sarbuk in the doubles, yeah. which uh, you see in the mixed doubles, they, they jump over. really quickly and, and improve because they're playing with the men. Four. And mm. I think that's so Six. important for, for women's doubles because the rest of the world, they do that. They get the guys yeah. smashing at you. So you have quick improvements. Absolutely.
five, six. Confusion down the middle. Seven silver. Seven. Five. Cross the body on that one. Nine, five. Yeah, contrary to um, a lot of the other Japanese pairs, this pair really likes to play aggressive badminton, doesn't it? They 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 want to attack. They want to go in there. They want to really finish it, which is uh, a little bit unusual. But I am sure if they suddenly stand across a, a very very strong defence, then they are also more than ready to run. Right. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure they are. <laughs> If you ever so watch the done. Japanese uh, yeah. train up and Six. down, up and down, run, run, Nine. run, and uh, hard, hard workers, and uh, the respect in the coaches as well, and they they like to play well as a team. Great defense, but these guys like to attack. Approach defense. Got a few back. Not too yeah, much. She's quite famous for doing that in the mixed doubles as well. I think she, uh, Isabel Hertrich is uh, more well known for her mixed doubles with her partner Mark Lamsfuss. And Carla Nelter represented Germany at the Olympics in Rio with her former partner. So it's over. Seven, ten. I actually had to dig quite deep in the uh, history books and uh, found that the German pair won the uh, tournament in Russia called the White Knights in 2013. It's an international Eight. challenge day one. Ten. So that's uh, five years ago. Time they pulled it off. Nine, <laughs> ten. Matsuyama puts it into the net. Play. Well covered there by Patrick. And the Germans are back to all square, ten all. Ten. Yeah, you oh. see the way she serves. She gets her racket up right away and uh, able to read that. Oh, hi. Hi. Uh, out the back line. Well left. <laughs> yeah, that's what I would call well left as well. <laughs> or just missed. I, I would say good eye. <laughs> yeah. Takes the lead by one. That's what we say in Danish as well. <laughs> good eye. Got seat. Yep. Yeah, she had a smile on her face there. I'll take it. Yeah. And here we have the confirmation, 11-10 for the German pair in eight minutes. One, second, 
Eleven, ten. Play. on the German side. Japan tied up at an 11 apiece. Service over. 11, all. Service over. 12. Love it. Still a little bit in, inexperienced, I would say, the two Japanese, the way that they're lifting a shot like that, that far out the court, not really under pressure. Oh, swing and a miss. Yeah. Matsuyama. 13. Missed that one. 11. So the German pair is now 13 11 up. Serve, serves wide. That's the other. Some silver. Twelve. Getting on attack again. Thirteen. That's what they did at the beginning of the game. Cut off and puts it away. Really well played by Patrick. Oh, the way that she attacked that return of serve. I, I really like that also in, in yes, the women's doubles. Yeah. I, I think they have to be a lot more aggressive when it comes to return of serve. So well, if you watch their smashes, they come across a, lo a lot across court this uh, Japanese team. 14. Yeah, they actually 13. do play a lot of cross court smashes. I have to admit, it's the first time I see them, but I definitely think this is an exciting prospect for, for Japan again. Way out to Service over. 14. Oh. Neck and neck. Oh. Oh, we're to stepping into that one. 15. 14. Yeah, once again, as I say earlier. Why not test That's the front right. player now and again and see whether they're yeah. really up to it or they're just standing there. So uh, I would definitely do that. Hey! So the silver, 15, all. Sit on that one. A little lucky. 16, 15.
Shepard is stepping in on the defense yeah. on that. Take the chances. Oh. Katsuyama, she's really good, I think, coming into the net, putting 17. it away. I, I think that's when uh, 15. her strength. Yeah, she's doing well. She's, also, she's the younger one of the two. She's only 20. Samsova. 16. And 17. She was the one that played the, the World Junior Championship, uh, Championship twice in 15 and 16, got the bronze with the present partner here in 15, but won the gold in 16 with another partner called Obara. Sansova, 18, 16. Well, the German coach for quite some time, Wang Xu Yan. Yeah, he's been around for many years. I uh, trained a little bit in Germany. He helped out, but uh, his German's a lot better than his English, actually. 19. Yes, I know that. <laughs> <laughs> I know that. But it should be, shouldn't it? Yes, exactly, yes. Yeah. <laughs> so had Shu Wai Wen for many years in Germany, a bronze medalist at the World Champion. Samsova. Represented uh, Germany 17, for many years after Germany. 19. So the Japanese do just two Aye. points away from taking this first game. Matsuyama and Shida. are wor working their way into that rally. Sabisova. Got her caught on the left hip. 20, game point, 17. That's Carl Minaki. One of the seven Minakis. <laughs> well, left out the back, saves the game point. Yeah, five Sabisova. of them were in, into the badminton and... Uh, 18, 20. Japan to coach many years ago. Game. Game. Three points. Sahara, 21, 18. Good return of serve. Yeah. Just in between the two. You get jammed, it's hard. There it is. Well done. Yeah, you have to have really solid kind of uh, agreement on who's going to take shots like that. And very often you see that you know the front players fending for it and then suddenly not getting in and the player standing in the back, no way of getting it. So here we've got the confirmation, the two Japanese, Matsuyama and Shida winning 21-18 in 17 minutes against the Germans, Hertrich and Karl Nelte. <laughs> I even understood some of that. Can you believe that? My, my German is... Uh, better than I thought. <laughs> <laughs> no. I, I tried to learn a little bit. I think uh, back in the CD, uh, almost went out the window when, uh, yeah. like, isn't that what I'm saying? <laughs> Sounds German to me. Hot one, yes. 20 seconds. No, it's, um, Hot one, 20 seconds. I think he, the coach was very right that uh, yeah. they can't Hot. stand back and just wait. They, they must be on the aggressive. 
offensive situation now. They must try to push forward. They're playing the fast end here and just standing, lifting and, and, and hoping for the best is not good enough. Maybe one lift, but after that, they have to try get to on attack. Go, get on the attack and go in and counter-attack it. Second game. So I, I totally concur Love with all. that. Play. And she is serving. Love all play. Yeah, it's difficult to, to lift on this side, and they need that attack just like that. Oh, yeah. There you go. Well done, Morton. Yeah. Down attack right away. So, so yeah, that's the way forward for the Germans here, One. no doubt about it. Look. But the big question is will they be allowed to do so? Hey! Oh, beautiful placement. Again. Matt Suyama mixing it up. One. That's the ones that you want, the oh. mid-court shots really hard. She mixes it up, puts it on the body as well. So you're always guessing off the return of serve. Well done. Smiles. Good hit. Late. on this side, a little bit harder. Three. The wind is now One. behind the Germans. Let's try to get on attack first. Seven Silva. Two, three. strong by Ishida there, getting behind that Four. flick serve. Look at how she's Two. getting behind it, forcing, uh, even able to make kind of a scissors jump on that. That's really, really strong, good agility. Germans really haven't uh, challenged them at the net, too, and that's what you need to do to try to get that lift as well. Well, to do so, they must have Isabel at the front ah! if they want to challenge at the net. She, she can do it from her mixed doubles experience. Six, two. Oh, what a kid. <laughs> the spin. <laughs> Coach defense, good one. That's the one I was talking about, right there. Putting it to the net. Well done. And who did it? <laughs> Isabel. <laughs> exactly. Yes. Boy, we must be loud. They can hear us down there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we must be very loud. It is, comes in nice, takes the pace off. Nicely put. Thank you. Just enough, gets a racket up. And who was that again? Yeah, Isabel Hattwich. Yeah. She's got that experience from the mixed doubles and she's actually playing a very mean mix, mixed doubles. I think she's playing really well. Yes. She's, yeah. she's strong in the mixed. 
over there as Germany had Michael Fuchs and oh. Birgit uh, over there for many yeah. years on the top, and, and so many other great mixed players as Five. well. Yeah, so Six. true. Some sort of a, a tradition in, in Germany as well, yes. playing the mixed doubles. Five. She really puts it away too. She doesn't. Uh, she doesn't hesitate no, too much, does he? Not at all. Samsova. Yeah, Germany Six. lost uh, a very good, um, mixed doubles player, a male yeah. mixed doubles, Max Max Swinger. When he, he was um, he was just injured, uh, he just got injured all the time, and uh, eventually he had to give up playing badminton. But him and Isabel Hertig, they, um, I think they got a bronze at the World Juniors in the mixed doubles one year. But he had to give up due to injuries, and he was a very very skillful player. Seven, eight. 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 In on that one, but uh, down the middle. Oh, that was over. Nine, seven. Yuliana Schenk that got up to number two in the world too before she retired. Yes. So I know they all, all five events uh, Germany had strong players. Quick to the net. Delta. Samsova, eight, nine. Yeah, finding a very nice ankle there, Isabel. Patrick, really well played. Nice and steep in that interception. Try to Nine. have a look here. Oh. Finding both good angle and the steepness of that shot, really making the trick here. Good play. It's 9 all. down to the ground. Ties Sub it up at 10 apiece. 10. Oh. Close one, but uh, Germany takes the lead by one. Yeah, I'm not sure whether the Japanese knows that they can actually Multiple. challenge. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm not saying it was in, but it was really close, mm -hmm. and it would maybe have been worth a challenge. Let's see. Oh, uh, hard to tell on that. It, it's very hard to yeah. tell. Yeah. I'm not sure they actually know they can challenge. <laughs> <laughs> but really saving it. Yeah, they're saving it. Yeah. 
Rock. And Germany here Abwehr. into the mid-game interval. 11-10 up in 12 minutes. Einmal. Einmal und dann. Spiegel. Fort one, 20 seconds. Fort one, 20 seconds. Fort one. And we're getting ready. 11, 10. After the mid-game interval here, 11, 10, Germany is serving. It's uh, Isabel Hertrick serving. Play. So they're trying to play that counter-attacking shot. 11, she did not succeed 12. in it, but uh, the, the whole idea of it was really well. Doesn't go over. Doesn't go over now. Service over. 13, 11. She hits the tape right there. Hello? Either way, but stays on the Japanese side. Yes. There's the attack. Nice one from Carl Annette. 14, 11. Nice racket, let's watch it. There it is, snaps it down, puts it away. This is a great prospect again for Japan. I now watch them oh. even more, and uh, I still think they're quite raw in the sense that they are 20 and 21 years of age, but uh, they still have Stop. a lot to learn. But I think the potential is there. Right, yes. I, I, yeah. I definitely think, give it three years, four years, I think these two players can really play well for, for Japan. Maybe not the Olympics uh, 2020, but 24. Afterwards, yeah. yes. Yeah. I think they can do well. It takes time to develop your talent. It's not something that's hey, happening oh. overnight. Sixteen. Four. Again, getting on attack, and that, that's what the Germans are doing 17. so well now in the second game. Just yeah, I, pressure on. I think they should play the same way when it comes to uh, the third game, which I actually think it will, 17-12. Chances are that this match will go to three games. And even though if they get on the other side, don't be sort of thinking, oh, now I'm on this side, now I have to defend because it 13, has been proved to be very 17. successful to actually attack. So why not do that? Yeah, keep at it. Just keep doing it. Keep the pressure on. But let's see, maybe I'm jumping the gun, but 17-12 uh, looked good. Oh, 
fighting the way back. Now down by three. 14. 17. So hard during that rally, you have to get the next 15, one over. Yep. 17. Built a good opportunity, strong defense. That Eight. shot was really well played by Isabel Hattrick. Isabel. But missing that one, she can't be happy about that. smash out the body. Yeah, that angle shot, the uh, cross angle shot, that was really good, setting it up nicely. This one there. And actually, Carla Annette, to, to, to jump back on mm -hmm. that one too, kept the pace on. Yeah, good power. Eighteen, fifteen. Let's go, Heltridge. Sets herself up. Nicely. It's this shot that 15. makes a difference right there. And then puts it away. Again. That was a nice finish there by Matsu Niyama. It's almost going out on that back line, but uh, kept it in. And I like the way that she finished that one. So over. 16. Right there. 19. Got caught. Uh, let's see. Well in, <laughs> well in, not even close. It's not straight. 20. Game point. 17. There it is. Game point for Germany. Hey. 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 Puts in a flick. Yeah. Hey. Germany takes the second game. 21 17. Second game. One by Fought back. Hatic. Got on attack a lot quicker 17. in that second game and uh, one made game a big old. difference. Try to throw a flick in there. Into the net. Yeah, that's good fight back by the Germans. Even on the 
side of the court that's considered not the best. They had a very good fight back here. And it will be interesting to see how they do in the, in the third game, whether they really kind of found the recipe in order to upset this Japanese combination. Japanese, on the other hand, they're still making a, a little bit too many unforced errors. It's hard to say, but they, it's still a raw diamond. Uh, lots of things to be, be done on the Japanese team, but I'm sure that in, in a few years' time we will see a lot more of them. And here we have the confirmation. Japanese winning the first game 21-18 and then losing the second 21-17. All in 39 minutes. And we're ready to begin Carla Nelson serving. One more game. To Shida. Love all. And play. Let's love all play. The Japanese combination also had a very good start in the first game on this side. They had uh, four lovely 5-1 and then... Uh, the Germans got going, but they had a good start in the beginning Sub of that uh, first game. One, two. Say Japan wasn't ready, but then you're not uh, you're not supposed to move right. like she did. So uh, <laughs> I'm not sure about the no. umpire. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I guess he called it pretty quick. So uh, you have to stay still. You can't go for the shot, or it actually isn't a let. that uh, really tries to set up, watches the front so court right here, puts it down. Three, one. Good return of serve. Awesome, absolutely awesome. I love it. I really like when they're so aggressive. positive yeah, and really aggressive cool. about it. That is good. And that is something, as I say, I like to see so much more in, in the women's doubles. And, you know, the pair, which are Yule and, and was, Peterson, yeah. <laughs> they, they do it so they, well. They, they do yeah, it they all the time. And, uh, and that is really upsetting uh, the rhythm of uh, a lot of women's doubles pairs. So uh, I still think that's definitely the way forward. To, to go to yeah. be aggressive that way. Yeah. yeah, they're so good at the first three shots, two, three shots right off the serve, and then the next one as well. So. Put that pressure on. Four, the men seem to two. do it much better than the women actually off the serve. Hey, 
There it is again. Very good. Seven so over. Three. Four. Carlo Neto. Especially on this side, you don't want to flick and uh, you exactly. have to keep your opponents honest. But because of that drift, it, it's hard to do. Exactly. So take the chances. I would do that. Seven so over. Suyama again with the put away. Five. Three. Good play. A chance to take. She did it well. Gonna hit it with her uh, <laughs> little uh, sticks. I don't know. <laughs> Seven. I don't know. Well done. Watch this. Three. Very smart play. Just puts it back to the middle. Yeah, especially in women's doubles, going down the middle is so important. Sometimes you want to split them up, but then bring it back down the middle. So. Let's call in. And I like that again. I like that Eight. because it looks like Three. the Japanese duo is really thinking. They were under pressure on three consecutive return of serves, mm -hmm. and now they're flicking yes. two. I like that. Shows that they are really thinking. Another one coming here, unfortunately. She is playing that one out of the sideline, but Eight. again, the idea is there. Right, yes. Even if it's out, yeah, at least then the Germans have to think, OK, I can't commit. 100%. Exactly. So the Japanese pair is really taking stocks, which, which I really like. Seven well. silver. Nine. Mixing up their attack. Four. by Carlo Neto on the net. Samsoba. Five. Oh, just Nine. Mark it up. Cut it a little bit. Change of speed. Whoop. So four, four. Four. Too high. Samsoba. Ten. Five. Well, maybe we can see it again. Let's see if it's too high. Oh, that's tough. It didn't look too high to me. No, no, that's what I'm saying. This is only for the service judge to see. We, we can't really judge it from out here. Eleven, yeah, going into the uh, mid-game interval, 11-5 up. After 40, 49 minutes of play here at the indoor stadium in Singapore. And here we have the confirmation. 49 minutes. And it's 11.5 in the third game for Matsuyama. Thank you. Court one, 20 seconds. 
her partner Shida against Hertrich and Nelta of Germany. Eleven, five. So both teams, one on this side where Germany is ending. So you get a little bit more of the power. Yeah, maybe that's the difference. Maybe they need it. Again, if they want to turn it around, they need to get on that attack that uh, sooner than the Japanese duo. Oh, well left. Isabel Hetrich. Gets on attack. Watch this. Nicely done. Picks her spots. Seven, goes down the line and then seven. that one to the middle. Short lift on the racket, but into the net. Oh. So maybe a little bit of nerves right Eight. now. Germany, uh, hit, they can play steady, and uh, Japan, the younger team. Isabel goes cross on that one. Nine, twelve. We haven't seen that quite yet, so good timing. There it is. Beautiful spot. Uh, it seems like it's going to be a very tight match again. The German combination catching up here. Nine, twelve. Uh, definitely putting more pressure on at the moment. That was too short. That was definitely too short by Matsuyama. And that gave the Germans an, an opportunity to attack. And now there's just two points in it between the two pairs. 10, 12. Yes, again, Isabel on attack and then Carlo to put it away. The lead is slipping away. Definitely slipping away. 11 5, 6 points. Now 13 10. Seven Solva. Matsuyama. Easy put away. Ten. Gets her racket up. Watch us right down to the ground. That was very nice. Elizabeth Petrich challenging them at the net. You see her moving in a little bit quicker in the, and putting the pressure on. Samsova. 11, 13. Pointing it. That's a very nice comeback here by Hertrich and Nelta. <laughs> Not completely happy. Carl Munaki. Oh. 
support lift. Yes, they, they can't find the depth right now. Yes, they're on a slower side. Japan, they need to hit a little bit harder, but... Uh, okay, they can't find the depth. I oh. exactly agree with you on that. They're playing too short. Look at that. She's standing mid-court when she's hitting that one. Okay, you can't do that. Sharp on that forehand side. So it's over. The Germans have to 15, watch out for that. She's 14. good at this. Yes, very good. She reads the net so well and, and she doesn't she puts it hard back. Always keeping that pressure on. Oh, she in? That was a good smash. It was very steep. And tough for Carla Nelter to get back. There it is again. You watch her at the net. She's uh, already moving before they even hit. Out there, she's moving to the right spots. 17, 14. She uh, smashing. 33 shot rally. Yeah, Matsuyama is really putting nice, nice pressure on it as she's following up on that one. So very important for the Japanese duo here. And 18. 18, 14. 14 up, just three points away from tomorrow's final. Hey. Yeah, that's good. Yes. Placed on the line. But that's so also some of the things I'm looking, you know, 15, to, towards in, in, in women's doubles is the placement of the, the smashes. And so often it's all about trying to hit it as hard as possible, but it's, <laughs> and, and players are not thinking about how they place it. And here, her trick, it, she is really, really Play. placing it nicely. Right on the line, on the right side, everything is perfect. And you don't have to hit it that hard. Yes, no, no. The defense, I mean, they have solid defense, so you yeah. can't hit through. It's so no. hard in women's doubles. You have to think out there. You have to really mix it up. Yeah. Just forced it too much. Yeah, that's the second time 15. in a very short time span here. She's done the same, moving in and making that mistake of the net. Oh, 
there's that cutoff again. But this time over hit. Clever, clever play by Matsuyama here. Setting up match 20. point. Match 20 point. match point, 15. 15. Play. Good placement off the serve. Oh, yep. Germany staying alive. Saved one. Samsova. Still four to save. Can they 16. Can they come back? 20. Japan. Azuma. With match point again. Oh, very smart shot. There we go. And once again, Matsuyama playing the decisive shot here. She has played a really good match and been very decisive in many, many occasions in this match. Really well played by the two young Japanese, 20 and 21 years of age. So Matsuyama and Shida from Japan here, winning in three Mets games. Yeah, watch this. That's what makes a difference. Great attack, but it's how clever Matsuyama is at the net. Always putting the pressure on, and that time, very smart, places it so well and makes a difference. And we have an all Japanese women's doubles final tomorrow. And as the players are leaving the court, here we have the confirmation. Matsuyama Shida from Japan winning 21-18, 17-21, 21-16 against Hertrick and Nelta from Germany.